It is World Prematurity Day today, a day meant to raise awareness for preterm births and the risks these babies face. Today we are meeting a brand new Fort Hood soldier and his wife who are celebrating their surprise delivery. Baby Joseph Lopez was just four and a half pounds when he was born almost six weeks early. It's a story you'll only see here on Channel 6. While you were getting ready for Halloween trick or treaters, Romero and Desiree Lopez were getting a scare of their own. At two in the morning, I started feeling a little pain, but I thought I was just like, oh, I'm just cramping, like I'm okay. And it wasn't that it was I was going into labor. Little Joseph wasn't due until December 20th, but on October 31st, he decided to make an early appearance. He was 32 weeks, six days. The couple had just moved to Fort Hood. Ramiro was checking in for his first day at work when he got a call from his wife. I told him, can you please come back? I'm in a lot of pain and I need to go to the doctor. The new Army family jumped into the car and raced toward the hospital, their three-year-old son Josiah in tow. At first I, I thought it was just, she was just in, like, it's just contractions, it's not gonna happen, she's still too early. Then once she started saying that she needed to push, that's when I realized I was like, oh, wow, it's really happening. That's when the couple spotted Baylor Scott and White's convenience care in Killeen, and Ramiro immediately took a U-turn. I was like, I need to push. And so he was like, don't push, don't push, don't push. And I was like, no, I need to push, I need to push. And then we finally got into the parking lot, and that's when it happened. Out came my baby. Joseph was taken to Baylor Scott and White's NICU in Temple and has been here ever since. I never thought I would be like a NICU mom. Um, I always like read stories about babies being premature. Um, I never thought it would happen to me. For mom, dad, and big brother Josiah, waiting to take him home is the hardest part. I'm grateful he's here. I just wish I would take him home at the end of the day. Now, Ramiro and Desiree still are not sure when baby Joseph will be released, but we'll be keeping tabs on this amazing family and we'll let you know when they are all home together. We'll be right back.